at five. A local hospital CEO says plans are in the works to open an emergency room in Eugene after Peace Health closed the only ER in the city last December. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Matt Templeman. Renee is off tonight. In our top story here at five o'clock, KZI 9 News reporter Albert James shows us what that emergency room could look like and when it could open. Mackenzie Willamette CEO David Butler told a health care forum Thursday night his team is in the beginning phases of planning an emergency department here in Eugene. He says it's important emergency care is available 24-7 on this side of the Willamette River. We know there's a lot of great urgent care centers and we appreciate that, but this would be a 24-hour, seven-day-a-week uh, uh, freestanding or what we call a satellite ED. It would be on the same license as the hospital. As the project goes through its beginning application and design phases with help from local leaders, investors and developers, Butler already has some ideas of what it could look like. Initially we're looking at about a 12 bed uh, satellite ED. Uh, it would have the, op the ability to grow and expand based on the, the site that we're looking at. Butler says his team settled on a site somewhere in West or South Eugene, though he wasn't clear on where exactly that would be. Don't want to tell you about it because you might go out and buy it. <laughs> Uh, but it's got great access, over 25,000 cars go by there every day. And so we're very close to getting a contract agreement done and signed uh, that we're, we would go into the design and architectural design phase. As for when it could be open? Once we get the design and build phase done, it, we're probably looking at about a two year or two and a half year construction time frame. Coming up at 6 o'clock, hear from everyday people about the importance of having an emergency department in the city and the plan proposed by Butler. Reporting in Eugene, Albert James, KEZI 9 News.